Hello and welcome to YQ Academy Tutorials. My name is Priyanka and today I will be discussing arithmetic operators in JavaScript. I am using Visual Studio Code for running the program. I have created a folder named JavaScript and by using this I'll I have created a new file. So I have named this file as AOP that is the short form for arithmetic operator and .js is the extension for JavaScript. So first Let's print a welcome statement. For this, I have to write console.log. And welcome to arithmetic operators. To run this program and see the output, let's open a new terminal like this. And in the right side, a new terminal window gets open. Here, to see the output, I have to write node and the file name that is AOP. So, I have to write AOP.js. I can see the output as welcome to arithmetic operators which I have written over here. Now let's get started with the first arithmetic operator that is addition arithmetic operator. So for this I have to declare two variables. Um, I'm using let keyword and the variable name as x um, and I'm assigning 20 to it. Now another variable y and I am assigning 30 to it. Now I'm declaring a variable sum in which I'm adding x and y. So let me write x plus that is the arithmetic operator and y. Now to see the output I have to write console.log and then addition of x and y. Then I need to give the variable in which I have stored this value uh, that is sum. So And in the right side, I have to write node aop.js and by clicking the enter button, I can see the output addition of x and y is 50. So, uh, if you see over here, x value is 20 and y is 30 and the output will be 50. Now, let's moving on to uh, subtraction arithmetic operator. So, let's write the keyword let and the variable name this time uh, will be sub and then I am writing as y minus x. Now using console.log let's write subtraction of y and x and I need to give the variable name as well so I am writing sub. Now in the right side in the terminal window I will be writing node aop.js and by clicking the enter button I can see the output subtraction of y and x is 10. So 30 minus 20 will be 10. Now moving on to another arithmetic operator that is multiplication arithmetic operator. Uh, so for that let's write a variable mult and I am writing x and the multiplication operator that is asterisk sign and y and to see the output I have to write console.log and then multiplication of multiplication of x and y then I need to give the variable name that is mult and in the right side again I have to write note aop.js and by, by clicking the enter button we can see the output uh, that is uh, 600 so 20 into 3, 30 will be 600 now let's move to another arithmetic operator that is division arithmetic operator so first let uh, let uh, declare a, let's declare a variable div and then assigning value to it y divided by x and again by writing console.log and like this division value and then um, writing this uh, variable name and in the right side terminal write node aop.js we can see the output division value is 1.5 Now let's move to another arithmetic operator that is modulus. So I'm declaring a variable mod and I'm assigning value to it 
y and the modulus sign will be percentage sign x so it will return the division remainder which means that result of modulus operator is the remainder of an arithmetic division let's see how so let me write console dot modulo value then I need to give this variable name where I have stored the value and in the right side note aop.js I can see the output so modulo value is 10 now using increment arithmetic operator let me write x and this is the increment arithmetic operator plus plus uh, let's store this incremented value of x in z keyword so the variable uh, sorry so the keyword is let and the variable name is z and I'm storing this incremented value in z and by writing console dot log here I'm writing incremented value and I'm giving the variable name z here in the right side right note aop.js I can see the incremented value so if you see here uh, earlier the value of x was 20 and by using the increment arithmetic operator that is plus plus um, the value the new value is 21 now using decrement arithmetic operator that is minus minus let's do this with y variable y minus minus let's store this decremented value in a this time let's see the output now console dot log and I'm writing decremented value and now I'm giving the variable name that is a where I have stored this decremented value and in the right side in the terminal window I'll be writing node aop.js to see the output and by clicking the enter button I can see the decremented value so if you see earlier value of y was 30 and by using the decrement operator that is minus minus we can see the decremented value as 29 so the last arithmetic operator is exponentiation arithmetic operator so exponentiation arithmetic operator and the sign for this is double asterisk and actually the exponentiation operator rises the first operand to the power of second operand let's see this by an example so let me write a variable first I'm using a variable name as e and I am doing x and the exponentiation operator sign that is double asterisk and 2 so uh, the first operand uh, will be the power of the second operand so exponentiation operator rises the first operand to the power of second operand now see the output using console.log here in the right side write node dot uh, sorry node dot file name aop.js and by clicking the enter button we can see the output output of exponentiation operator is 4 for 1 uh, for the first operand the power of second operand so that was it for today's video thank you for watching